please. This is your weekly message. What's going on in your energy field this week? Okay, take what you need to leave the rest. Earthly Virgos, what's going on with your energies this week? Okay. The Two of Wands, and we have the Page of Pentacles. Follow with some kind of uh, regret, heartache, things that you've left behind. Don't keep on contributing to your own mess, your own drama, Virgo. If you've gotten out of it, if you have lived another day to talk about it, don't keep re don't keep rehashing the past. Kind of like let it stay where it is. You're you're different now. Things have changed. You you have decided that I'm gonna move on away from this. I'm not gonna have to deal with any kind of negativity. I'm not gonna have to worry about the fallout. I can't carry. I can't keep contributing to this burden and this heartache or whatever that it is that I'm going through because you it's still hung up it's like you're still hung up in it you know you may be over and done with the situation or the person or the issue but don't take what what you're already over and done with and it's already gone you, you're holding on to it it's like you have you ever heard of the phrase you can't see for looking okay you can't see for looking you're always worried about everything that you've been through in your life but don't because you still have treasures that you have yet to find. You have you still have treasures that ha that have yet to be picked up and held by you. Okay, you've already moved on away from all of this stuff, the 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 the, the, the angst, the hurt, the pain. But you're c you're constantly contributing to it. It's like you're dropping your coins in, into this into this fountain that that's already been that has already been closed. It's like you already wrote the check. You already balanced out your budget or whatever it is, but then you 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 wrote another check on the same account. You can't do that. You got to got to get a whole new check, a whole blank check, a blank slate, and start over again. It's it's too much of a burden, but you keep holding on to it. You you, you don't seem to want to let it go. Okay, whatever it is, you gotta let it go because you've already it's you've already released it. You've already released it, but why are you still holding on to it? Okay, you want to do something different. Okay got to start fresh you got that two of cups that you don't even realize is there you got opportunities that's beckoning for you but even though you're headed toward new opportunities for whatever reason you're afraid to, to grasp the concept that you have the opportunity for something brand new you know, like if it's a man or woman a job or whatever okay sometimes we got to make some of the some of uh, decisions that we really don't want to have to make but it's for our own benefit it's for our own good and the benefit of others and the others that we love okay Virgo what's going on for you this week Queen of Pentacles we have the world card it's like choosing to make a decision to to possibly find another work another job are, are more opportunities for you here because out with the old it out is the time is out look time is out for you worrying about something that, that's already over with the, it's like the bell has rung school is back in whatever it is you however it is you want to phrase it it's, it's this is over with you know this shit here that's been going on it's over with for a reason it was for your own good for this situation this job this opportunity this love relationship it's over with okay let it let the past stay where it is you know because you're leap, you're taking leaps of faith and you're and you're joining new people you're seeing new people experiencing new things it's time for you to let that past go leave that past out in the call say i'm a little rough around the edges i know that i've been through a lot of shit in my life but i gotta move on because i'm so much more that you're the queen of pentacles okay and you're the queen of wands you got to move forward and realizing that you are better than you than you gave yourself credit for but two understanding that you are so much better than you really than you realize okay fuck what people have said that you wasn't this and you wasn't that and you'll never do this or you'll never achieve that so what everybody got to start somewhere okay give me messages for the earthly virgos energy this week here please what's going on for the earthly please spirit what's going on earthly holding see you're holding on to something and you it's like you're you're holding on to opportunities that are right before you uh, a new opportunity like a new way of living a new way of thinking but you're holding on to something from the past you uh, it's like you probably have already stepped into the next level of your life but you won't you it's like you 
kind of like you, you're taking the stragglers with you. It's like you're walking and you got somebody hanging on to your leg and won't let it go. Don't go nowhere. Don't go nowhere. Even though you you crossed that threshold, you're taking their bullshit with you. you gotta cut it out. Cut it out. Tell them to. to <laughs> you know what to tell them. Virgo, what's going on this week? See. And then we got you, Magi magician. It's like stepping into the power that's already before you. It's already there. But you letting these stragglers hold you up. You know, keep on, you keep tripping over your own foot because you got somebody hanging on. Hanging on for dear life. They're probably their lover. Okay, that job or whatever the situation is. Some, something or somebody is holding you back on purpose. But you got to say stop. Enough is enough. Back, back up. Get the fuck away from me. This is my life and I'm going to live it the way I want to live it. The way I choose to live it without you dangling on to my every word. Without that cord constantly dangling on and holding on like it's, your, like it's your tail. That's not your tail. Cut it off. Cut it short. You got to protect yourself but also protect what's yours. Opportunities. It's like you have to fight the battle. But you're so confused. Stuck. Stuck. Why are you stuck? Because you're afraid of what tomorrow may look like. You're judging yourself wrong. You're judging. It's like you're allowing what other people say to keep you stifled. What other people do to keep you stifled. It's like you're listening to the naysayers. You're listening to what these people say you can't do. Or you shouldn't do this. Or no, no, no. Susan, you can't do this. Or, or, or Erica, Erica, excuse me, Erica, you can't do that. You know, talking all of this yin yang. Okay. Give me some more messages, please, for the earth, please. Message for the earth, please, please. Got the Knight of Cups. We got the Tower Card. You, it's like people say stuff, and you take what they say as being the truth. You, and you know, it's it's like let what these people say. They get up in a group around and, and, and plant ideas in your head, you know, uh, if I tell Sherry this, she gonna believe every damn thing I say. If I tell her she ain't gonna be shit, she ain't gonna do shit, that's exactly what she gonna do. And that's that's what that's what's hurting you. You're letting what these people say, these naysayers, keep your uh keep your panties in a in a ruffle or whatever. Keep you down in a dungeon and the the low way of thinking the way they are doing. Because they don't want to see you grow. They don't want to see you succeed. Got the eight of cups here, just like we did there. Got the Eight of Cups. It's time for you to move on. But you don't know what tomorrow looks like with this moon core. So you're taking your time. But we got some justice here for you. Opportunities coming in your way. Life, A life flourishing. New opportunities. Somebody's going to tick you off if they already haven't. You know, about what they're... Kind of like how they're feeling. It's, it's like... You know what? We have the ace of, of, of wands around you. This energy around you. They're saying that you can do whatever you put your mind to once you stop listening to people who say you can't. Three of Pentacles. This is probably a job. Doesn't have to be though. And we got the Page of Swords. It's like, don't put too much thought in what people say about you, whether it's at work, family members, or whatever. You got to do what's best for you and your family. Where do you want to go in your life? What do you want to do to get this Ace of Cups? To get these new opportunities, these opportunities for you. And two, judge. You're going to find one person in your life who's going to not judge you in a negative way. That person's going to reach out and say, look, I got your back. Whatever you need, just let me know. Whatever encouraging word you need, let me know. This could also be spirit saying, look, I got your back no matter what anybody says. No matter what anybody does, I got your back. Okay. We got the emperor. We got the king of wands. Opportunity galore coming your way. But you got to move. You got to boss up. You can't be afraid. You can't hold yourself shackled to the past heartaches and pains. You got to let yourself blossom. Let yourself grow. And let yourself open up and be wide and ready and open and ready to receive the greatness that spirit has to offer to you. Alright y'all. I hope this message resonates. I will see you all in another reading. Okay. And get out of your head. Okay. You're thinking about something or you're thinking about somebody. Get out of your head. Just let it go.